The Sabbath. Statement of fundamental belief number 20 in three minutes. When you are a slave, your identity is found in what you do. If you're a slave in Egypt, your identity is found in what? In bricks. I got this from one of your beaches. It probably it just washed up onto one of your beaches from Egypt. <laughs> if you're living in Egypt, you're a slave, your identity is found in this. Dad, what do you do? I am a, I'm a brick maker, son. What will I do? You will be a brick maker, son. Uncle, what do you do? I'm a brick, brick maker, son. Uh, grandfather, what do you do? I'll be a brick maker until I die. Mom, what do you do? Well, I birth brick makers. And I make lunch for brick makers. We are brick makers. And when our usefulness to the Pharaoh who has found our identity in brick making is over, he discards us, just like a toaster. When you have a toaster that can't make toast anymore, toasta, sorry, toasta, that doesn't make bre <laughs> bread anymore, toasted, you don't keep it on the counter because it's been with you for a long time and you love this toaster and it was a, a wedding gift or whatever, you throw it out. When your identity is found in what you do, you're a slave. How does, how does God remedy this when he sets his people free? He does it this way. It's a commandment. Remember. Remember the Sabbath day to keep it holy. Say it with me. Six days you shall labor and do all your work, but the seventh day is a Sabbath to the Lord your God. On it you shall not do any work. Neither you, nor your son, or daughter, or manservant, or maidservant, nor your animals, not even the animals, nor the alien within your gates. Why? Because the Sabbath is the day when God says to us, you don't belong to what you do, you belong to me. The one, the Holy One, Jesus, said this to us, if the Son has set you free, you are free indeed. On Sabbath, we enter the space where we're reminded as we drag all of our junk and our brokenness we're reminded, hey, you're, you're not what you do. You're not what you do. You are who you are because Jesus called us his son. So on Sabbath, happy Sabbath, when you say happy Sabbath, you are not sheep herders, goat herders, quokka herders, whatever you got to say. <laughs> you're not a temple priest, a lawyer, teacher, administrator, pastor, conference president, accountant, electrician, contractor, business man or woman. Uh, Broncos or Sharks fans, I don't know who you, who you have out here. You're not east side, west side, red, yellow, black, and white, mocha. You are a child of God. Don't be tempted by that weed growing on your backyard saying, come pull me on the Sabbath. Don't be tempted by your inbox calling out to you saying, you're nothing if you don't check this today. Don't be tempted, student, by that book telling you, come study right now. You tell those things. I am a child of God today. Happy Sabbath.